Hi, this is Bupinder Tube. Welcome to my channel. If your Camstasia is choppy, delayed, or out of sync, you're at the right place. In this video, I will show you what you can do to reduce any delays in your editing. So, first important thing to do is to go to the setting by right clicking on the start, then going to settings. Here we need to go to system. Here we need to go to power and sleep. Here we need to go to additional power settings. In here, we should have something like show additional plans. Click there. There, additional option should appear, which is for selecting high performance. Select that, and then you can just close this. Close that. So we're back here. So this is one of the things that you could do. The second thing you could do is to go to edit, go to the preferences, go to advanced tab. Here you see a place called hardware acceleration. You need to select, see I got so many options. If you select use software only mode, it can also help. So click, select that, then click on OK. Another thing you can do is to make sure your project setting by right click here, clicking on project settings, the dimensions, the canvas dimensions, the frame rate match your clips. So I took a snapshot of this setting as you can see and now I can close this right click on one of these and click on detail bring the snapshot back and you can see the setting matches the one that's there for the project and the media file so that's another thing to make sure they match obviously another thing that's important is the location of your media file and your project file so if I right click on the media file and go open file location you can see I have saved this file in the C drive not in an external hard disk so make sure your project file your media files are, are saved in your internal hard drive and it's not saved in a cloud for example such as OneDrive this video wouldn't be complete if I would then mention about other two options or other two things that you need to consider. One of the things is if after making all these changes and your video is still choppy, you need to download a software called Handbrake. You can find that in the description of this video and then convert your video into MPG4. You can see here MPG4 and then use that video in your editing. That's another important thing to consider if the other options didn't help you to make the system more smooth. And then the last thing that I think is obvious that a lot of people should know is the system requirement. This is Camtasia system requirement. 16 GB RAM is recommended obviously but 8 GB is a minimum. And 4 GB of available space but here it says also if it be SSD hard drive it would be better. Also you can find the system requirement in the description of this video. The next thing you can do is to apply your cursor effects at the end. Any effect you add to the timeline it unfortunately makes the editing a bit slower. So if you add your effects at the end of the process or just produce the video and then bring it back to your Camtasia and then apply the effect in the second run. That could also help. And the, another thing you could do is to reduce the length of your videos in the timeline. That has a direct effect on how smooth it, it can run. So if it is 10 minutes long video, you can divide into two, five minutes and then edit them separately and then on the final edit bring the two clips together join them together and produce it 
using the shell. Hopefully these steps help you to reduce any delays in your editing and make the experience of Camtasia more nice. If it was, please don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.